Michael Jackson, Black or White. Het is 9 voor half 9. Het is 90's Request. En ja, het is, uh, het is wel even een dingetje. Dat merk ik aan alles. Het gebeurt niet heel vaak dat er mensen ook echt... S ochtends vroeg al voor de deur staan. Dat wordt ook niet beloond overigens hoor. Dat je niet denkt van, oh, dat ga ik morgen ook doen. Maar het is toch wel even opvallend om aan te geven... dat ze nog steeds hot en happening zijn. Dat bleek ook wel. Afgelopen weekend zei ik al, stonden ze in uh, Hoi Rotterdam. Back to the 90's. En ze zitten nu tegenover mij. Ty, Terrell, and TJ, guys, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? And thanks for being here this early. Thanks yes. for having us. <laughs> so, uh, how was Rotterdam? How was the Hoya 90s gig? Oh, that was a lot of fun. It was amazing. amazing. Yeah. It was great. It was great. To see all the fans and to be able to spend a special moment like that was, was wonderful. Brought back a lot of memories. Yeah, of course. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> I, I don't know, did you have time to check any other artists? Because uh, there were a lot. No, we just no. came in. We actually landed that morning. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. yeah. so <laughs> quick we, visit. we took a quick nap and then uh, got ready for our performance. So, But is it hard? Because I know, uh, Terrell and, and TJ, uh, you're busy with, with new material. You're just writing songs. Yes. Yeah. Um, what, what kind of well, music is that? Is, is, it, is it because, well, 3T, like, well, we know it. It's <laughs> well, pretty 90s. Yeah, yeah. Well, we've been um, writing ever since back in the day. We've never stopped doing music. There was just certain things that happened in our lives that, you know, we had to tend to. But um, the music's grown. You know, it's it's. I'd say it's more uh, organic. Yeah. A bit more live organic instruments. live instruments. Okay. Um, but we're excited. And Ty, um, you are working on a, a, a zombie series or a science fiction <laughs> project, something like that. It's an um, action movie. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, it's it's going to be very exciting. Okay. Um, I don't want to give too much away. That's no, the thing because no. it hasn't been done yet. So that's why I'm kind of like. But it is it, it is with zombies and things like that. It's with zombie like uh, it's more in the 28 days later okay. uh, category than zombie. Okay. 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 <laughs> <laughs> and, and ondertussen zijn ze dus ook nog wel gewoon steeds druk met. Nou ja, daar waar ze vroeger uh, druk mee zijn. Sterker nog, ze gaan in oktober. Uh, nou ja, dat is deze maand al. Gaan ze in Engeland uh, op tour, de Big Reunion, uh, Big Reunion uh, Boy Band tour. And Daar zitten ze echt allemaal in hoor. Al die boybands van toen. Blue 5, Damage, Fifth Story, uh, A1, oh, 911, 911 was het geloof. Nou, daar is hij weer. Sorry, seems to be the hard It's gonna be fun, guys, to work yeah, with yeah, all the yeah. well it used to be boys, yes, <laughs> and, yeah. and now all the all the men. Some of them are still boys, though. Yeah, <laughs> of course. So in your head, I guess you yeah. are a still boys, yeah, living yeah. the dream. Yeah, yeah, it's great. It's just it's it's crazy because it's been so long. But um, you see so many familiar faces, it's, it's like a dream. So. Yeah. You share stories, war stories, you know. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's crazy. Yeah. It's crazy. So what was one of the highlights of the 90s, you think, for you? For us, it was yeah. just living out our dream. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. You know, since since I can remember, I wanted to do music and perform in my own, you know, on my own stage. Yeah. You know, growing up with my family, you see... Of course. So yeah. many, you know, my uncles and, and my aunts, you see them on stage and you just want to be like them. Yeah. So being able to do it our, on our own was was a dream come true. Yeah, a highlight. Of course. And, 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 uh, and well, everybody uh, uh, well, will ask something about it. You are, uh, well, the nephews of Michael Jackson. Yes. Mm-hmm. Um, how, how, how was your relationship? relationship uh, with uh, him um he was he was the best the best yes the best most image. amazing person uh best influence for us not only as musicians um as people mm. uh he was just such a, a special person and uh i think about him every day yeah of yeah course. Well, well i do and it's yeah. not even my uncle of course yeah. but yeah. um um what what, what what was your age then during uh, uh well he lived it was well, you, 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 yeah, we we were, you know, we were with our uncle from the beginning. <laughs> yeah, that's then, a, that's um, our quick because yeah, we I mean, grew up. We with were like him. his kids. Yeah, before he had his own. <laughs> yeah, you know? so yeah, we, yeah. we grew up with them and we yeah. learned so much from him. And then when we learned of his passing, it it yeah. was devastating for us. Actually, then, actually, we were in um, Holland mm-hmm. eighteen years ago watching his performances. Oh, really? Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. You were mm-hmm. there? Yeah, a fan From, told to this us. Day. Yeah, so. Okay. But, well, a, a, lot of, uh, a lot has been said about Michael and, and 
Uh, mm-hmm. His relationship with, with, with uh, younger kids. Mm-hmm. Yes. Um, yeah, you notice anything like that? Never. Uh, Never. No. It's, 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 it's very sad. In, in, um, it's sad what the media did yeah. to him. It, it upsets me. And, and just, I mean, obviously, you just play black or white. And it, it affects me still to see, you know, in both ways because it's so positive. But it, it saddens me to see what he went through. Yeah. Because um, a lot of the negative media was unfair to him. I think it's, the the better you are as a person, you know, the bigger the target you are. Yeah. And that's yeah, yeah, yeah. that's what I, as I get older, that's what I see. So, you know. I think so- the hardest part for me is that, uh, like, majority, a lot of people believe that. And that's very upsetting and hurtful because a lot of people believe that garbage, you know. And, and if you really knew him, um, it would it would upset you too because... Honestly, he he was the best person I've ever met and will be. Yeah, it saddens me. Can I introduce you to Fleurs? She's my yes. news host. Hello. And uh, well, she's here every day and telling bad stories because that's news. <laughs> um, and and uh, well, she told me a few years ago. Yeah, three T. I like it. But what I never knew is well, lot more seen now, Fleur. I was a really big fan. She I has have this crab book. She has this book. With oh, wow. pictures very much. Wow. <laughs> and uh, it was also my first concert when I was 14. It was oh, wow. in Ahoy. Yeah. 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 Wow. And all the hits, uh, they, yeah, you can see them all, natuurlijk. <laughs> I need you. Is that also you? It worked. Uh, you, you wrote it or you sang with it, Michael Jackson? No, it was it was a song that we was was presented to us. That to be honest, we didn't really care we don't for. Do it. We didn't want to do the demo. Okay. And then our our <laughs> uncle had heard. It. I think the label wanted us to do it, and they went through my uncle. My uncle called us wow. in the middle of nowhere and said we it. had to do it. <laughs> And we say, I need you. This is the song. We're talking about the same song. And he's like, yes, do that song. So we, we obviously listened. And, uh, and he it was, was recording it was right his album decision. at the time down the street from the studio we were working at. Okay. And he came in to watch, um, to, to help us record it. And that's when Max Martin and uh, Dennis Pop the produced producer. I Need You. Yeah. And they asked him to sing on it. But um, he was hoarse from singing a rock song from his album. So that's why his voice is a little hoarse. Oh, really? So I gave it a try. Yeah. Okay. But yeah, it was, it was a lot of fun. Wow. And that was one take, too. Yeah. Mm-hmm. His, so what you hear is that, that was, on his performance song. was one take. No, Kijk, En zo is het. Die muziekgeschiedenis die herschrijft zich nog steeds. Echt nooit geweten.